<laughs> again. We're going to have you build this automation. I'll just be here, your cheerleader. I'll, I'll help you answer Yay. questions as you're doing it. So, so yeah, so you've moved your vault much. into Google Drive. Yeah. Hi, guys. We are coming back from, from a little break. I'm back now again in this video. What I did in the meanwhile, I moved my vault from uh, F drive to my Google Drive in here on my private one. Also, you see, maybe this is, I'll be able to zoom in in the make.com. So let me share my screen like this. And then we are going to go with Google. You're going to need, yeah, Google Docs, Google Drive, and, and open it up. For those of you who have never used make.com before, they have these things called modules. So it goes by application. And then within each application, there are multiple options you can choose from. Right now we have the Google Doc one. Mm -hmm. It has watch docs. Again, this is important because it's going to pay attention to see if there are any new documents coming into the right folder. Mm -hmm. You got to give it permission, sign in through your account. Meet recordings. That's it. Let me it. Two. Okay. From now on, press the... Uh... Let's do it from now on. I'll, I'll be able to specify later if I want. So we're going to add another module. We're going to go add docs. We're going to get content of a document. Yep. Same. Material connection. Baby is crying there. I, if you're hearing it. <laughs> I actually cannot. Yeah, nice. Here's the document ID. Document ID, yep. That's correct. Okay. So now you want to do, to add a router, correct? Correct. So route, this is router. Okay. So first we're going to actually add a file there. So let's do Google Drive. Are you doing this all from memory? Oh my God. Man's yeah. got a steel trap. So we are now going to Create a file from text. Yeah, I'm just, I hear it. Here's an account. Oh, this is a separate module. That's why it's asking me to log in again. Mm -hmm. okay. Maybe it's doing something good in there. I can hear bravo, bravo. <laughs> <laughs> text file location. Ah, so we're going to put it in my, oh, I logged in with the wrong, so I, this should have been where the vault is, correct? Yeah. Okay. So let me choose another one. And so the idea here is you're probably asking yourself, why do I need to take the Google doc, which has what I want and go through this process. And it's because Obsidian only really reads markdown files .md. So all we're doing right now is essentially converting the Google Doc itself into a .md file. Why is this restricted connect? It's not possible to use restricted scopes with customer at Gmail accounts for more. Oh, that's why. You can't, you probably have to set up like an OAuth or something for a personal account. You can't, since it's not uh, like the Synthlines yeah. account or whatever. So technically I could use my drive on Synthmind's account. That wouldn't be a, issue correct yeah so what i've done is i have it i have my vault on my personal account but i shared it with my synthminds account so that i can still interact how did you do it. that so go to your personal yeah one okay. where it is and you just go to you might need to do it in google drive i don't know can you share from the system finder so what do we doing show more up share with google drive yeah is that it Nice. Share with uh, my synth mine. Yeah. Okay. Open. Now you should be able to go back to make and just when you're choosing your drive, you choose the share, share with, with me. me. Mm -hmm. Okay. Makes sense. I think it's a good that it's good that we have actually these kinds of issues because people would probably yeah not the same. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, how did they make that work? Okay, you gotta take some extra steps if you're using your personal account. So this is you gotta go to shared with me in the oh, yeah, yeah. Drive. yeah. Sorry, sorry, yeah. Obsidian brain. Yes. 
file name is. I just cool. go with document ID. I don't want the document okay. ID. Yeah, Leave me you alone. Can do whatever. <laughs> you can do whatever you want. <laughs> Let's do it like this. How do you put the date? Current date and time. Huh. Like this. And then we add like this. And then we go like this. And then we add an MD. No, you don't have to do MD yet. Uh -huh, okay. File content is text content, correct? Correct. Correct. Convert the file to Google Docs. Doc. No. Nope. Okay. And then we add another Google Drive. But we add now. Upload a file. Where is it? Upload a file. Okay, so we found it, we got a content, we created a file from it, and now we added it to... You want to send it to wherever you brain. just want the transcripts to live yeah. in your vault. That mine's folder, here. Meeting transcripts, there it is. Okay, so now it's file going name going to be file name. Yeah, and this is where you put the dot .md. Yes. The end. And then just make map? sure data says text content as well. You're going to have to go down to the next. Yeah. In the Google Docs. Uh -huh, okay, okay. So we are pulling uh, back from the actual Google Doc. We're not pulling the content from the file that we created in here. That is true. It's very possible that you might be able to just skip that module. I'm not sure. That's what. So now we want to add another one, which should be an open AI. Is it open AI or is it a chat GPT? It's probably open AI. It's open AI, yeah. Loading, I clicked something. I don't know what I clicked. Completion should be occur. Yep. Yeah. I am somewhat of a automation expert myself. Yeah, you're better at this stuff than I did. It took me a while to figure this out. So this is Turbo, yeah? Yeah, I use Turbo. I would recommend it. It's not that expensive, and it has such a huge context window. And then I did, for role, I do system. So let's see. Messages, add item, role, system. What do we want to... And this is where you put the prompt, so I can send you the prompt I have, and you can... Sure. ...date it based on kind of... Because obviously it's specific to me. Here you go. That's... I sent it in Google for you. They're going to see our chat. But now let's do this. And now. Yes, add it to the prompts. Prompt, uh, script. Summary. Okay, mission. Just make sure you must place my name with your name. Let's go back to make.com. And then here I'm going to delete this. That is the ID of the... The idea here is that we want to create a backlink directly to the transcript. However you name the transcript it. is what you want to put in there. That should be the name of it, correct? You can get rid of all the black stuff and the slashes. The now. Really? You just need one. You just need whatever it, like, it is exactly called and... In the transcript. Okay. Yeah, let's do that. And then out of that, we are going to... Oh, well, we're not done yet. Oh. So you, you want to go down to item two or add another item. Here. Okay. Because remember, we want to actually send the entire transcript to. I have this as role user and... And then the message content is just text content. You could okay. probably do it all in one, but I figured it'd be better to keep it separate. And uh, that's that. Okay. Is, are we done with the OpenAI the, mode? The, the only thing is I, I did have, I set the number of tokens to 750, but you can set that to whatever you want. It's lower yeah. depth. Oh, I don't want the temperature to be one. 
to look to yeah I have my temperature to zero probably better don't want to get in creative on me max tokens yeah I'm going to ask West to give me I'll put 2,000 that's way too many <laughs> okay it's like almost becomes useless at that point I'll put 1,000 yeah 1,000 is fine okay that's fine. What's the output of this? So we need to actually put this into... So it's the same thing, the create a file from text and then upload the file. It's just you're going to upload it now somewhere different. I like my dates in there. So we we will have... What's this? This is probably a message in here. Yes, exactly. Content. It goes choices and then message content. This is now then... This is the actual file. File name. You don't have to put the content in there. The content goes dot along the bottom. Yeah. So let's do the. Just do the. I have ID. the name. Just the file. Very good. In the original Google Doc. Ah, oh, yeah, you're right. Or we can do a document ID. Whatever, whatever your heart desires. Mm -hmm. And then content goes in here. Yes. Word file. Okay, and then we do again an upload of file. Name. Dot md. Yep. Data. Is. The completion from ChatGPT. Uh, yeah. Choices, message, content. That's it. Correct? Yep. And what's the third bunch? Well, the third is if you want to move the transcripts that it's done into a specific folder or whatever, like an outbox of some kind, or just to let you know it's been done, you can do that, but totally optional. Yeah, I don't want that. Let's so then you should be all try good. this once. Run once. I, I don't think it's going to run. It's probably not going to find anything. Yeah. So we will do this. Choose where to start. Just manually. What can we do? Sure. Probably empty, but we'll see. The magic happens. Yes, it's looking good so far. My turbo is faster than yours. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> Play some fun music at this point. Speed us up. <laughs> I have the worst habits when I actually either I hum on the meetings, as you can notice, or. I mumble in my mouth when actually I'm writing something to somebody like, oh, shoo, 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 shoo. <laughs> yeah. So this is okay, let's see if it worked. Let's see. Where's my obsidian? Yeah? Give me a summarize meeting. Oh, very nice. Ooh. This is got, I have the date. I got the, oh, I doubles the date because there is a date already in the trend. Okay. I'll fix that. Nice. Do the tasks say to do after them or whatever you have for checklist? Have you downloaded checklist? I didn't download the checklist. Oh, so that's not going to work for you yet. But there is, I can actually. Yeah, but it's not going to feed into anything that you can keep track of. Fine. Just... So obviously yeah. you can set this up for any transcript service. So you could also have Fireflies. You could do Zoom. Whatever. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, Joe. This is uh, amazing. Thank you, Chatters, for staying with us. Yeah, so hopefully this is helpful. We'll share the, the blueprint and uh, some other information. Uh, you you shared you. the blueprint with them, but you didn't want to share with him. Yeah, because okay. you it's need okay. to learn the hard way. <laughs> okay. Thank you so much. This is amazing. Yep. We just need to figure out how to change from the completion. We now just need to find what's the proper name to actually use for this file. Because this is ugly. Yeah. For my super visual eye, as you can see, I'm a very visual guy.
<laughs> yeah, totally. You could do another chat completion. This feels like such a waste, but then have that chat completion. Be Just be a name. The name. <laughs> yeah. That would be probably the best way to do it. Hey, I'll summarize this name, this format, put it in a more, yeah. That would yeah. Be amazing. And you could use, you could definitely use 3.5 for that. You wouldn't need anything definitely, crazy. Yeah. Okay. Thank you so much. <laughs> yeah, see you later.